I'm just going to outright say it. I think G4 TV is view botting. Yeah, G4, that old TV channel that was dope on cable back in the day before they just aired 24 seven cops. Now, if you don't know what view botting is, it's paying a service to inflate your views. It's a bunch of robots tuning into your channel and it makes it look like there's a bunch of humans there, but really there's not. And you do this to make yourself appear popular and hope that people will follow the flock of humans. I could sort of prove it with some basic facts, but we don't have like conclusive evidence. But I think when you see some of the facts that I have, you're probably going to think the same thing. Now, again, this is all allegedly. I can't like straight up say that I know 100%. But I'm like 90%. I'm up there. I'm pretty high, pretty sure personally with my opinion that they are viewbotting. Our first piece of evidence requires us to go back in time when the attack was a Twitch channel. This is when Kevin Prayer tried to bring back attack of the show in the form of a Twitch channel. And I'm not going to lie. It was super dope. It had a lot of the same energy that attack of the show had in the past, but nobody was watching it, you know, and that's just how it goes. Sometimes you can make something super amazing, but you can't force everyone to want it and to expect all the young kids to want something that's old. They want new stuff, dude. They want like Roblox and they don't want Kevin Pereira's old ass. So this guy started view botting the channels to make it look and appear more popular and he got caught and he acknowledged it, which got that entire channel banned. It just demolished that entire show. He has a history of doing this. Our second piece of evidence. This is a really big one for me as a Twitch streamer. I'm able to see the numbers and kind of put things together. I've done this for many, many years. Live streaming on Twitch was my life. I'm very familiar with how to spot fake traffic here's how you find out all right so here's a vod from three days ago and if i zoom in here for you guys bam it says 587,000 views that's a lot of views on a twitch stream but here's something really weird all right i'm gonna zoom back out normal speed normal size and uh now look at this chat look at this chat right here it's it's like a, me a message per second if uh, uh if it's going fast okay um that's fast is a mess uh, one chat message per second i see streams with like 20 viewers have chats this fast okay so this is not a stream that has half a million people stop by throughout its duration just from the chat speed alone the engagement shows you that the number of people it says were there is not the number of people actually participating. Let me show you the difference. Now, this is Hassan. He has about 36,000 viewers right now, about the same amount that G4 claims to have had. And look at this chat. Look at this. I can't like I'm trying to scroll and keep up with. There we go. It like got stuck. Look at that. There's a huge difference. OK, this is 30. This is 30,000 real people there. This is not. Look at this chat. It, it's not even moving. There's not 30,000 people there. We could take a look at Soda Pop and even his chat. He has about 30,000. Same thing. Look, there's two channels, 30,000 views that really have 30,000 people there. And then here's one that does not really have it. This is why I think they're they're totally botting. Now, also, their YouTube channel had about 20,000 plus as well. It was going crazy. My next piece of evidence is the meltdown that happened from Frosk. This is what made everybody super pissed off at G4. Like, I was on board and I still am. Like, don't get me wrong. If you look at the G4 TV social blade, they've been bleeding subscribers and they barely get any views. On my main channel, I'm getting five times more views than G4 is getting per day per hour me just little me so if they're getting like 20,000 views a day that's really bad but if they're getting 20,000 views a day how do they like hold 20,000 viewers at one time on a live stream another piece of evidence and you can see the big cancellation happening everyone's exiting you know when you yell at your fans it makes them not want to watch you I think that they're botting I think that the history of Kevin Pereira botting the old attack of the show you can see the speed of the chats it doesn't quite add up myself former pro twitch streamer I've seen thousands of people come and go on Twitch and I know when someone's view botting but unless we have like some sort of transaction and proof or someone admitting it you know like he did before we can't say 100% but I can say like 90% maybe 99 you know I'm really certain anyways guys that's all I got to prove what I think I would love to know what you guys think or if there's any other evidence out there they can help prove that they are totally view botting thank you guys very much and that's pretty much it see ya